But this is a good helm. Or, I think it's a good helm. Plus one attack is always great. Alright. Let's do... What did we decide on? Rune script, right? And like, if you want to see a particular mission when I am closing in on choosing a mission, just shout it out in chat. Do not shout it out in your room because that's not gonna, yeah. Mm, dad jokes, you know. You are walking down the road when the sound of many wings pulls your gaze to the sky. What is it? Above you, you see a large flock of red birds flying southward. We're not gonna... Not gonna shoot the red birds at that height. You figure a well aimed arrow could bring one of them down to make a nice meal. Then you decide... Eh. I don't really... I'm a vegetarian. So I'm gonna let them pass. Your mission is clear. I think These elemental cultists are just stealing yourselves for I think I have a pretty good team for the first room here. Ignore negative scenario effects. Oh no. She doesn't ignore negative scenario effects. Oh god. He does. And she does. So I basically have two people that will... Oh, I have one person that's going to be affected by the scenario effects. Five or more monsters or the first one to kill? Uh, let's try five or more. Sure. I need him to kill one of each demon. If he does that, I think he only misses a sun demon. If he gets one of each this time. Use no items. I'm going to use items. <laughs> Never take purist. Protector. That's fine. Mm, your health at the end. This is die hard. That's possible. Maximum health at the end of the scenario. That's not too hard. I do have a lot of healing here. Let's do that. Of course, we're not going to be able to do that huge, insane first round that we usually do. Oh, this isn't too bad. I thought there would be so many more guys in the first room. <laughs> okay, we're going to go with the net shooter. Um... Net shooter isn't good here, so I can only hit one guy with that. Let's do Toxic Bolt and Enhancement Field on you. You can see all of my guys start disarmed. Except that only one of my guys do, because I'm immune to the scenario effects. The traps here are damage traps. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I do have mana potion, so I can get uh, I can get some uh, earth for the crag heart here. Hmm. I can do the throwing knives. They will do three damage each. That's decent. Or I can do flanking strike. And open wound. No, um, and pull someone.
I don't have dark magic. No, I don't want to go early. Crap. Swift bow? Not doing that. Let's do this one and this one. Okay, then I can go for him. Uh, you can, if I'm lucky, I can immobilize both of these. One of these, actually. Damn it. I think we're gonna have to take some damage here. Oh, we could go with a big, unstable upheaval immediately here. And stun? Ooh. Okay, that's kind of tempting. And... Mm, now we have the chance to stun everyone. Or not everyone, but most of them. That's great. Uh, you... Like, he can't really do anything <laughs> useful. So we're just gonna jump somewhere and... Chill out. Okay. Let's see what happens here. They move at 7. Attack for 3, that's that's not too bad. They're... Okay, they're healing. That's not too bad either. Okay. Okay. This is fine. Oh, I don't need to use this. I actually <laughs> have this one up. Uh... Okay, so now, yes, I'll probably do, probably go up here and do the big attack with the stun. Why not? Let's go attacking him. Yes. I always have this advantage against these guys, so yeah. Done. Yeah, let's do this. Poison on this guy, sure. Mm, I'll do you glide goggles hair sure. That's good. And turn. Okay. This just feels like yes, I want to do this. Okay, let's go. And we start off kind of strong here. And we avoid all of the healing. That's kind of what ticked me off. I do not want all of this healing happening. Skip ability and... Okay. Strong start. Um... What am I doing next? I'm probably doing an attack on this, 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 this. Yes. And we're gonna heal him, I believe. Can't attack. Okay. We've got this. Oh, was that seven initiative? Was that something they got back? I'm not sure. Let's do monobol with heal and do impaling eruption here. The problem now is that like 29 is my quickest initiative. Hola! How are you doing, Kaliap? How was playing Rust earlier? Was it good? I did not understand a single word you said. 
I was just dropping by and I was lurking there. Rust looks like something that I would like to play, actually. I don't know if a lot of people here have any... Any experience with that? Looks kind of cool. Okay, we got to think about what we're doing here. Oh, of course, of course. I mean, I usually stop by... I can't like watch streams too much uh because you know i have i stream myself and i also have a girlfriend <laughs> uh that i live with so i try to stop by streams and watch a little bit i really enjoy watching streams but i often keep them running though on my computer okay what are we doing here like Hmm. We kind of want... We could do Dirt Tornado. That's not bad. We could heal someone. We could do Chalking Grasp. Actually, Heaving Swing isn't too bad here. We would kill him, probably. Okay, let's do this. Uh, you need to do something about these. Uh, I'm going to take this back. We're going to need to push someone into a trap. <laughs> and... Yeah, the graphics were... I guess it could have been better, right? I'm not sure what like what frames you usually run on. I didn't have any problems with the frames. I'm not the person to talk with about these things either. <laughs> um Oh, this is good. We can move up here and move him into the trap. That means you probably crater Hmm, it's not a good idea. Let's do Heaving Swing instead. And here. Oh, he's stunned. Okay. I think he's dead. I think he's dead. Not sure if he's gonna die. I'll pick up a stun shot here. So we can react to whatever happens. Um, let's do those two. Let's go. Okay, we get attacked for three. Or he gets attacked for three. The cultists are kind of useless. Cool. Wait a minute. What's my quest here? Have I killed anyone? Because the Kragheart needs to be the first one to kill. Or did I choose something else? Now I don't remember. I feel that this is like just... Yes, we're gonna do this. Absolutely. Do I need the power potion? Probably not. Okay, let's go. Ooh, the power potion would have been nice, actually. <laughs> and we'll heal this guy. Okay, this is this is going well. Your health is equal to the maximum at the end we might as well just throw a dagger on him mm. you are going to kill this guy okay you can kill this one you can try and kill this one yes okay he's gonna die now really Oh, 
<laughs> that is always satisfying, right? Um, I think we're taking this side first, but I have the Cloak of Invisibility and a Piercing Bow. Yes. I know what's in there, and the Spellweaver is just gonna take care of it, I think. <laughs> He's pretty strong, yeah. I mean... I don't know how familiar you, you are with this Kaliop, but he used this card, which is a burn card, so he can, like... This card he can't use again. So that's why it's so strong. I used a burn card on the sunburn dude as well. And that's also pretty insane. So that was like your ultimate ability kind of thing I did. Except he can do that a few more times. Gloom Haven, man, if you like strategy games, this is... Sick. I love this game. I'm like in... I'm in love with this game. Kill five or more monsters. You're not doing a great job here. Because you haven't killed a single one right now. No! I forgot he needs to kill the night demons. Crap. Boom. Ah, damn it. Do we go in and do fire orbs? Just jump in here. Do ride the wind. Get in. Do fire orbs. I think we do. And we're gonna go late with the other people. Hmm... I've burned one card. I think we're doing very well. There's two more rooms here. I could open them simultaneously, to be <laughs> completely honest. Um, I guess we're just looting with him this turn. Okay, sure. And you want to go and you can do a hook gun. Let's look at this hook gun and he can bring back a burn card to someone. I really like that ability. Oh, someone may recover all of their discarded cards. Uh, I don't want to use that yet. Let's just do shield or something. Probably not going to use the flamethrower right now. This doesn't really help me at all. Okay. But yeah. Okay, I'll go take this one. But yeah, now that I think about it, like, this guy's just super powerful. <laughs> That's what it is. Now, we want the Kragheart to actually kill one of these. Uh, but I think maybe... Oh! Oh, right! The Kragheart can kill him! Nice! 
Oh, look at that. Krag Kragar can kill several of them. Mm. Do I go invisible here, or do I just take the hit? He has used this one, two, three, four. I think I go invisible. So that these guys move forward. I actually didn't kill two of them. That's pretty sick. But it's really good for both the like personal quest and for the combat and the mission quest here. They are just standing there. That's fine. I think someone has to run into the fires, though. Yeah. I'll take a hit. Uh, never allow your current hit point value to drop below half your maximum hit point value. Round it up during the scenario. <laughs> well, <laughs> we weren't able to do that. Mm, do I... I just chill out here, I believe. One, two, three, four. That's good. Uh, yeah, fine. Yes. Uh... Do I do this? Yes, I do. Good job, Cragheart. Nicely done. Uh, what's the movement on the skeletons? The living bones here? Four. One, two, three. Okay, so they're probably gonna be able to reach me. I'll do... I'll do backup ammunition now, right? Okay, he's killed three out of five monsters now. That's pretty good. You'll use those two. I'll just pick up some gold with him. <laughs> I think. I mean, we can do this and see what happens, but probably just gonna like... Oh, look at this. Three cards, all of the movement five. <laughs> We've cleared two rooms. I think someone said like three people is easy. The easiest? I think four people is. This is... I feel like I'm just running through every mission here. Without any... Oh. and plunder! Appreciated, Kaliop! Alright! Thank you! And you got to hear that awful, awful alert I made. That alert is going to be replaced at some point. <laughs> it's really loud for me, though. <laughs> oh, thank you. So. I mean, I haven't burned a single card with him. Maybe I should give some cards back to... The scoundrel here. I think maybe that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna do one adjacent ally and recover all of their discarded cards and we will heal someone. Probably uh, he's gonna heal himself. Then I'll move at... Can you move later? No. So he moves at 11 then. Let's go. They move four and attack one enemy with all their attacks. This is like, this is Living Bones Elite. This is sick. 
You actually got got the founder badge there, Calliop. I don't know how many I'm missing now. But like I think it's like the ten first people. That subscribe, get the founder badge. And at some point I'm gonna I'm gonna work on some uh, emotes and stuff. I mean, I have more subs, but uh, the people that were gifted subs, uh, I have more subs. <laughs> yeah, but a lot of those are gifted subs, Calliope. So they don't get the founder badge. I am, I am big streamer. I, I have lots of people. I really appreciate it, man. Like, every single sub right now is awesome. It's always gonna be awesome, like... I get to play games and just talk about them. Which is what I love. And that someone enjoys watching that is... Cool. That is freaking awesome. Uh, okay, let's look at the movement on these guys. One, two, three, four. So they're gonna be able to get there. Hmm... He's gonna move away from them. That's... It is! I know you say that, but, you know, if... I, got, I, I could work less, or I do work less right now, on my, like, real job. So, getting a few extra funds, you know, through, uh, through Twitch is pretty awesome. <laughs> this is true. Well, you could actually order a beer online, just like I would order one from our liquor stores to my address. So it's doable. <laughs> not giving you my address, though. Like... <laughs> You do not have my address. That is, uh, I'm, I'm not. Uh, that is not like uh, free information uh, just yet. <sighs> okay, we gave him all of his discarded cards back, and we are healing up the tinkerer here, who failed his mission. Sad. Uh, we gotta move over here, I believe. One, two, three, four. Yes. So we didn't get to do a lot of damage this turn. <laughs> all right, all right. Yes, he could run up there. That's... Man, look at this. Oh, God. Blood Bowl? Absolutely. You play that game? I am... Yes. I would say I'm a fan of Blood Bowl. I haven't tried number three yet. That might be... Well... I am the worst loser ever. Blood Bowl brings out... The worst in me. Three? Oh my god, what, what's going on? <laughs> Is it good? Is that it? Or... Uh, yeah, we'll do... We'll do these. I guess I do open wound here. I played a uh, bunch of Blood Bowl to this uh, spring, so I put uh, I got some games out on YouTube. Uh, 
But then I lost a couple, and then I didn't play it anymore. <laughs> uh, we're doing Open Wound, obviously, but uh, what else? Like, Okay. Can I de kill these guys? That's kind of the question right now. I'll do a healing and give someone a card back. He's gonna do a long rest. Yeah, let's just try this. Uh, attacks for three, three people. Hmm. Oh, they move kind of early. That's a problem. So he's gonna be attacked by both of them. But he can take it. That's fine. Unless he goes over there. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, God. Uh, of course, he's not next to any of my allies now. No, no, there's Blood Bowl 3. Yeah. Came. I think it came in like August or something. Yeah, we did some damage. That's good. Sadly, uh, that was just kind of terrible what I did there. Okay. We're gonna have to heal him and give him a card back, right? Do I need any. I'm probably just gonna burn someone with him. And I'll do Rumbling Advance. Rumbling Advances. You can go kind of early next turn. That's good. Two damage. That's fine. But they heal. That is not fine at all. Hmm. I shouldn't take, like, these living bones too lightly. They can actually do quite a bit of damage. Well, I mean, if you punch them hard enough, they just break, right? <laughs> what the hell? That was good. Um, yes, we are keeping that. Uh, probably not using Icy Blast. Ice Blast is shitty. Like, Ice... Why isn't... Would Ice Blast be too strong if it had three a pair? I don't really think so. I th still think Fire Orbs would be close to the level. To that level. Um, yes, are we attacking... With this probably we have a loot here so we're gonna move down here so we can get the gold next turn we'll just attack with three I believe maybe you go punch him I don't know <laughs> Uh, what can you do? You're gonna generate some stuff, that's good. Hmm. Okay. He's gonna move four and attack for three. For the king. What is that again? Uh, is that like a turn-based game? Yeah. Well, that looks interesting. Hmm. Living Bones Elite. I'm moving at 45. Do I kill him? That's the question. 
Oh, yes, we do. We got him. I think actually we got him with the rumbling advance. Um, yeah, let's just move here. We're not going to attack because we want the kill to go to our crag heart. So we can do his... Uh, not personal quest exactly, but yeah. Does he have a loot card? He does have a loot card. Okay, cool. There's a lot of gold here right now. <laughs> and yes, we're gonna pick it all up. The binding of... Isaac, do I not have? Uh, I've heard about that. I'm not that much into like roguelikes. Mm, I could heal people. I haven't played too ma many at all. Uh, I don't know. It depends. It depends. I give like the, the mechanisms of the game is are good. I love it. Like, why can't I... Aren't you supposed to be able to just do the heal here? That irritates me. I like games where you gotta think, but I will be honest and say that, like... Graphics is part of that. I do enjoy the graphics being decent. Um... Sadly, we're going to have to stand still here. Well, I mean, I play, I also play like Fallout 4 and Skyrim and Valheim. I play Heroes 3 of Might and Magic, Civilization. None of those are roguelikes, but I do play a bunch of games. Yesterday, I was playing War Tales. Uh, we're gonna do the loot here, and then... Yeah, nothing else. He's gonna long rest. Let's go. I think... Nano allies. I can short rest this guy, so... We'll just pick up... This one? Yes. Hmm. But War Tales is like, that's a big one for me. Darkest Dungeon. Number two. I gotta play that. At the next opportunity I get. Uh, what do we remove here? I'm Dirt Tornado. We can get rid of that. Or let's do Heaving Swing. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, we're just gonna run over here and just crush everything in here, so. Um, volatile Contraption. I am gonna... Yeah, I'll throw that away. Do I have something against the Tinkerer here? <laughs> the Tinkerer never <laughs> finishes his uh, <laughs> quests. It's weird. Oh, do I not have any kind of... Okay, okay. Now... We're going to use... Are we... Doing this? We might as well just open to the next... Yeah. <laughs> I appreciate it. That's... That's... That is how the world works. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. That is from a comedy. 
and uh, both of our, us are happier for it i hope <laughs> i got someone if you hadn't looked for that i would be sitting here silently right now well not silently but i do love to get some chat and some input when i play sometimes it's like hard keeping like i'll be going around like okay so we're gonna chop down some trees now and yes the the tree fell down let's pick up uh the lumber uh that that is my narrating of valheim at times when i'm lonely <laughs> uh okay let's do loot one we get the gold and then dirt tornado fine the rest of my guys don't really need to wait so okay he's gonna move really slowly here i'll do short rest on him sure Yes, we can burn that. We'll use these two. Fantastic. Now, the question is, do I just open with him? But did you... Have you played War Tales yourself, Calliope? No, the number here, mm, that's initiative. So like every turn, uh, the turn order is decided by the uh, uh, the numbers here. So if I am to choose like 48 and 72 here, I will move at 48. So you can see that the Tinkerer is now the last to move of my guys. And when I end the selection, the enemies will also show their cards. I could also, like, I choose two cards here, and if I choose 48, I go, uh, what, 48? I could also choose 72 as my initiative. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm just going to heal someone here, I guess. And move three. Who can move? This is move four. That's a bit much. Yeah, let's do this. This is just... Oh, I don't really need the Kragheart to use his loot here. Hmm. I think... Um, I mean, if it's not, like, super important to play that game immediately, I would probably wait until... They release more content. That would be my... Well, like... 40 hours ago, I would have said... Buy it! Buy it now! <laughs> uh, I don't need to pick this up, actually. Let's just move over here. Get some gold. And let's get ready to open the last room here. Um, yes, you're gonna heal him. Sure. I could open right now. But I don't see any point in doing that. If I open it right now, when you open a new room, all of the enemies are going to be able to move. So I would like open it and everyone would be able to move towards me. Or attack me. And... Then we choose new cards, you know. That would be pretty shitty. I want him to go first. I want him to open the door and then move back. So we're going to use Ink Bomb. Because it has four movements. Calliop, seriously? You are like, yeah. I am a huge fan of those. Did you play Griftlands? The card builder? That is 
a game I intend to play on stream again. You haven't played it? I know, if you like card builders or progressive card builders, man, I love that game. Um, I could do net shooter, probably. I know what's in the room. Sure. Uh, I'm gonna do massive boulder here and. I don't know. Forceful storm? Sure. Yeah, I think Griftlands is. Oh, yeah, Griftlands is a favorite for me. We're gonna do a long rest back here. <laughs> Uh, let's short rest this. That's fine. Okay. We've got this. Uh, okay. He's just... Moving. Then bringing all the cards back. This is a game I intend to... Uh, play with with people on stream I really like this game and uh, it's more fun to play it with others to be honest what do these guys do they move three bastards uh, one two three oh actually okay so he moves two right these guys are standing still. One, two. Can I see? I'm going to stand here and we're going to do the net shooter here. I will immobilize these two. That is fantastic. Now there's a chest back here, so we need to make sure someone can get that. Uh, Cragheart doesn't need anything right now. They're not really that bad. Uh, they have retaliate, so if I go clo uh, close to them, and I hit them and I don't kill them, I get for the elite here. He retaliates for two, so I take two damage. For every meal, a melee attack. Okay, all of these three guys. Punch them in close combat. You take three damage. Two damage. But you can see, like, these guys have shield. See the shields over here? Two shields, that reduces all damage they take by two. Okay. Crag arch is done. Let's get rid of smoke. No. I think we'll throw out sinister opportunity here. But I mean, like, this game. When you start playing it, it's it is really hard. Flamethrower is a burn card. That's pretty good. Do I just attack for two on two people and then move? Sure. That seems like a good idea. Move back. I think. So the Spellweaver is going to be able to use the move 8 here to take this chest at some point. I'm going to do probably do the Fire Orbs. Yeah. Nobody gets exhausted. That's fine. Um, let's do Swift Bow and Quick Hands. We're going to pick this coin up and run a little further. 
Then we're gonna go with... These two. And selection. Okay. Frost demons are trying to heal. Healing self for three bastards if there's frost. And there is. And these guys are also healing. Uh, so not a lot of stuff happening here, to be honest. Okay. I guess I attack these guys then. Uh, I'll go here. Okay, this is frustrating. Uh, but it's fine. I mean, I have, I have a spell weaver with all of our cards back. That's just sick. Uh, yes, let's do the move and loot. Awesome. I mean, I'm picking up so much money with the the scoundrel here. Oh, critical hits live, man. Hello, welcome in. When you guys are raiding me, that means I've been playing for way too long. But okay. <laughs> I'm just finishing up my last scenario here. In my flesh, f fresh playthrough. Well, I, I would, I would beg to differ. Because if you get sloppy in Gloomhaven, you die. <laughs> but I mean, we're cruising through hard at the moment. With our uh, new team here. We really haven't seen much, like, danger. Yeah, I guess, I guess we use Sentinel Growth here. Okay. The Sadist here has already killed three uh, guys. So what have you been uh, playing uh, Critical Hits? Or Dr. Friendship? Who was playing today? Friday. Mm, I don't remember. What game is it on Friday uh, over at your place? Great channel, by the way, to everyone here. Critical Hits Live. Go follow them. They play Gloomhaven. They play Wildermyth. Oh, yeah. You should avoid uh, Fridays, because it's that Dr. Sweet Brown. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Dr. Sweet Brown is hilarious. This is. That is the channel I am most often into. <laughs> <laughs> yes oh man i was watching uh, dr friendship uh cuts uh for the youtube videos uh the other day sweet brown uh when you mentioned that a civilian had been killed in one of your role-playing uh sessions and you just said like a civilian was dead and then you just started laughing didn't look like you were role-playing uh, even DSB is Dr. Sweet Brown, who uh, streams, is one of the streamers over at Critical Hits Live. You also have Dr. Friendship. Kaliop is, it's very confusing with these guys. Because I, normally it's Dr. Friendship when Critical Hits Live is talking. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna short rest here. Absolutely. No reason not to. I can lose the dirt tornado. Sure. I guess we do forceful storm. Or hmm, massive boulder. 
We actually have the enhancement field here. Let's do that. Mm, I'll do Ride the Wind and Icy Blast. <laughs> Man, it's like, this is one of the problems when it's getting late. When I have chat and it's late, uh, like, the game doesn't pro progress at all. <laughs> I guess it's not a problem. I mean, the... No. I'm tired right now. But I'm uh, enjoying this new team. Mm. I don't think I can just go ahead and burn two cards right away. I want to make sure nobody actually exhausts. So I'll go at 66 here and I'll move. Well, I might be here a bit later. <laughs> I thought you did. Okay, so it's only Fridays for you, uh, Dr. Sweet Brown. I wasn't aware. I mean, I've seen you because I've seen you a couple of times because I. Fridays is one of the days I play a bit later and I, I raided you guys. <laughs> and then it's always you there. Um, okay. We need to move forward the scoundrel. One, two, three, four, five. He's not going to be able to help. I'll do smoke bomb. Sure, that's cool. Let's go. Whoa, move five and move four. That's a lot. Move three, that's fine. Mmm, I'll do... Can I actually hit someone with this? I cannot. Damn it. I didn't check that. Uh, I guess we're just skipping the attack here. I'm not really worried about anything here, so it's fine. Let's try and kill these two. Might get them. That's not good enough, sadly. Damn it. That's like... That's one away from killing this one. So we're gonna have to take an attack for three, which is completely fine. Honestly. Let's go. Oh yes, I have noticed that. You weren't there the other day though. When I saw you laughing and I mentioned it and I was like, where is Sweet Brown? We need to talk about him laughing at dead civilians. Because <laughs> if you're not, like, this is what I tell my students at school as well. You gotta say things to people's face else it's just mean you know <laughs> uh i don't tell my kids that by the way i don't tell them to be that they should be mean to each other um let's move five let's go Man, like Smoke Bomb? I always just end up using Smoke Bomb because I can. <laughs> or very often, that's what I, how I end up using Smoke Bomb. Uh, I think we're gonna do like a big throwing knives with the Smoke Bomb. Actually, we're gonna have quite a nice little... Uh, Attack here. One, two, three, four. Okay, that's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a big attack next turn. Uh, I can attack these guys. Uh, 
Sure. That seems fine. Oh, look at that. Damn. I have the battle axe still, so I can run here and do the flanking strike or something. Awesome. We're not gonna get the Voon, but that's fine. I think I'll be killing both of these guys. That means I need to do Ride the Wind to make sure I get the chests. I think everything dies right now. Yes. Let's go. Really? Okay. They're just gonna stand there and shield. Okay, that might give us the opportunity to get some more money. Let's go. Boom! Oh, that is actually 15 damage, right? That was cool. 15 damage, I'll take it. Nice. And yeah, join the Longboat or my Discord if you want to, like, influence what kind of games I play and stuff. Or you want to get a quick reply to anything. Um, let's go over here. How are we doing with the quests here? I think we're good. I could actually have attacked there. Damn it. Okay. I'm gonna try and just do this one. If I kill someone, I can loot. Nice. I could also just move, which would pretty much do the same thing. Okay, let's just go there. And... Can't use this right now. Okay, we'll just kill him here, I believe. I could... Okay, what? Why am I critting everyone? Or uh, getting double damage on everyone right now? I could have kept this going for a little bit, but... And gotten more gold. I don't like the amount of gold that's left here. With the cultists and their mini... You must have alternative. She's been... Scoundrel got six piles of gold, so we, we're good. Oh, Spellweaver only did 34 damage here. Man, Cragart in the first room? That was sick. Uh, I forgot about this. Damn it, fast healer. Okay. Can't do anything about that. Let us... Let us see. We're gonna do the city... I did win Kaliop. Absolutely. Uh, Plane of Elemental Power and Frozen Hollow. Okay, cool. Uh, we're going back though. Because I'm just gonna level up now and check if there's something to buy and then I'm gonna go sleep next to my dear dear girlfriend. Who has corona? <laughs> like seriously, they just opened up everything and stuff in Norway after his corona. Uh, and we have like vacations or winter holidays and then just now we got to stay home. That's a shitty start to the vacation, uh, to the winter holidays. Uh, probably, probably. Sprig, hello. I am. I mean, the girlfriend has the Omicron virus, so I'm pretty sure <laughs> I also have it. And I'm. Well, you know how when when someone close to you says they're like, "Oh yeah, I've tested positive," it's like, "Oh my god, 
No, I can feel it. I can feel it in my throat immediately. So yeah, I feel it in my throat now, after she told me. Uh, okay, city encounter, you awake in the middle of the night to the sound of alarms ringing in the west. You recognize them as the warning clangs of an attack on the wall. Any force bold enough to assault the defenses of Gloomhaven can't be good. For a moment you are grateful for the prolific number of guards defending the city, but still, there is always the possibility that the guards may not be enough. We are not gonna do what Sweet Brown would do and steal valuables, we're gonna go and aid in the defense of the city. You're done streaming for the, today, uh, Sprig? <laughs> Appreciate the lurk, man. You rush toward the west gate, eager to fight back the invaders. As you approach, you see a mass of wormlings climbing over the wall and attacking the guards with daggers and arrows. You yell and charge into battle. Into the battle. It is a rough fight, but you emerge victorious, covered in fur and blood. The citizens of Gloomhaven remain safe. The town is free to grow and prosper. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> all right mm, like i think with the crag heart when i level him up i always end up with the same cards well actually the level two cards i could go both ways <sighs> Here we're like, yes, clear the way is clearly better, I feel. I mean, an attack for eight, that's cool, but it's a burn. 21 initiative is good. Retaliate is... Uh, I'm trying to go for like... A ranged build this time. I haven't played too much Scoundrel, Sweet Brown. But now I'm going for like more AoE since it's in a four man party, is the thinking. And that means more ranged attacks, I believe. Mm, let's do Clear the Way. Yes. I think so. I love the like throwing daggers and stuff. I think it's really cool. Crushing Grasp has to go, I believe. Yeah. I mean, I've played some of these classes a lot. Uh, but some of the characters I'm not really that familiar with. I didn't really play that much uh, Guildmaster, for example. Hmm. I don't want any of these. I do want them when I get the triangles here. I think like I think it's more interesting to play him ranged. Right? I I do I like ranged characters. Period, actually. <laughs> I mean, my strategy is to not get hit. That's like, I, when I play the Sunkeeper, I do not uh, en enhance the extra shield on that... Uh, what is it? Defensive stance or whatever? Because I don't use defensive stance. <laughs> I mean, I just go for hybrids. I think it's interesting. I've watched like Sprig play a lot because uh, you play like, oh, it, <laughs> that works better for me uh, time-wise. Uh, and I do a lot of things similar, but some things are like extremely different. Because I've never like read any guides or anything, so I'm like, 
I have my way of playing some of the characters. I've noticed watching other players that I burn cards so much less than others. Okay, we're gonna level up to level three. Yeah, okay. Like here. I mean, these cards are just freaking amazing, both of them. I love Element Laid. With Wind? Mmm. This is so sick. But, <laughs> the top here. Well, definitely. But I think, like, this is the first time I've really used uh, Smoke Bomb too much <laughs> on uh, the Scoundrel. Uh, I think that... I think that's really useful. <laughs> that, I think, it was a mistake I uh, made earlier when I played the Scoundrel. I was like, eh, I don't really like the pull or uh, the burn here, so... But I can see how powerful it is. Mm. It's like qualifier is so strong. And I have healers. Okay, let's go for cold fire again. <laughs> I just don't like the level 2 cards on the Spellweaver. Icy Blast? I, I kind of want to remove Icy Blast. But I guess it's going to be Freezing Nova then. Sure. And since we have Cold Fire, we need to get... Some fire hair as well. Oh, and some cold, I guess. Yeah. I always go for these two with the spell weaver early on. Um, that does it for me tonight. I am gonna call it there. So, uh, man, nice to have you all in there, Sprig, Sweet Brown. Friendship and whoever else is uh, lurking around, Calliop, if you're still around, great to have you here. I need to go get some sleep now, and then I need to get myself tested tomorrow. That's gonna be fun. Those those sticks up your nose is just mm, not tired of that at all. Uh, I'll check to see if I can raid someone and I'm gonna try and also uh, be able to turn off my own stream when I raid someone. I've noticed in like the VODs, when I raid someone, you can actually sit and look at me watching other people. <laughs> I did actually watch 10 minutes of me watching uh, Critical Hits. The other day i was like wait doesn't the stream end here and then it's like seriously 10 minutes of me watching friendship and dr sweet brown playing gloomhaven i believe good night